Welcome back to another video from your friends here at Altitude University. I'm David, and today we are going to talk about anti-collision lights, how to use them, and the rules related to flying your drone at night. Before we begin, please hit those like and subscribe buttons so we can continue providing you with more drone-related content. Flying drones at night opens up a new dimension of possibilities for aerial photography, videography, and other drone applications. However, it also introduces additional risks and challenges that require pilots to follow specific regulations and safety measures. The FAA has established rules to ensure that drone operations at night are conducted safely. Let's start by listing some of these regulations. Part 107 Certification to fly a drone at night commercially, operators must have a remote pilot certificate issued by the FAA under Part 107 of the Federal Aviation Regulations. This certification requires passing a knowledge test covering various aspects of drone operation, including rules, safety practices, and airspace classification. Click the link for our course below to learn more. Night Waiver Previously, a waiver was required for nighttime operations, but updates in the last few years have integrated night flying into the standard Part 107 rules, provided specific conditions are met. Anti-collision lighting. One of the critical requirements for flying a drone at night is the use of anti-collision lights. These lights must be visible for at least three statute miles and have a flash rate sufficient to avoid a collision. Operational awareness. Operators must maintain a visual line of sight with their drone at all times, which can be more challenging at night. The FAA advises using a visual observer to assist the pilot in maintaining awareness of the drone's position and surrounding airspace, although it is not required. Night flight training. Operators are required to complete additional training focused on the unique aspects of night operations, including the psychological and physiological effects of low light conditions, night illusions, and the importance of good lighting. Weather conditions. Night flying requires careful consideration of weather conditions. Visibility must be sufficient to maintain visual line of sight, and operation should be avoided in adverse weather conditions such as fog, heavy rain, and strong winds. Now let's talk about anti-collision lights and their use. Anti-collision lights play a crucial role in ensuring the safety of drone operations at night. These lights help make the drone visible to other aircraft and pedestrians, as well as make it easier for you to see the drone as you're flying it. The FAA mandates that these lights are visible for, again, at least three statute miles and have a flash rate that effectively signals the drone's presence. Here are some of the characteristics of effective anti-collision lights. Visibility. The primary function of anti-collision lights is to enhance the drone's visibility. As we've said a few times already, lights must be powerful enough to be seen from a distance of at least three statute miles. Flash rate. The lights should have a flash rate that is conspicuous and unmistakable. A steady, consistent flash helps to make the drone more noticeable against the backdrop of city lights and the night sky. Color and intensity. Typically, anti-collision lights are either white or red. The intensity of the light should be sufficient to stand out without blinding the operator or interfering with the onboard sensors and cameras. Personally, I prefer the white light. Example of anti-collision lights, LumeCube. LumeCube is a popular brand that produces lighting solutions for various applications, including drone lighting. LumeCube lights are renowned for their high quality, durability, and effectiveness in enhancing the nighttime visibility of drones. Here are some features of LumeCube anti-collision lights. Brightness. LumeCube lights are exceptionally bright, making them ideal for nighttime drone operations. They can achieve the FAA required visibility of three statute miles, ensuring the drone remains visible for a considerable distance. Mounting options. LumeCube offers versatile mounting options, allowing the lights to be attached securely to a wide range of drone models. This flexibility makes them a go-to choice for drone enthusiasts and professionals alike. Adjustable settings. These lights often come with adjustable brightness settings, enabling operators to tailor the intensity of the light based on the specific requirements for their flight. This feature helps in balancing visibility with battery consumption. Durability. Built to withstand the rigors of drone operations, LumeCube lights are durable and weather resistant, making them suitable for use in various environmental conditions. Rechargeable batteries. Many LumeCube lights come with rechargeable batteries, offering convenience and sustainability. This ensures that the lights can be easily recharged and used for multiple flights without the need for constant battery replacement. To effectively use anti-collision lights like LumeCube, 
for safe nighttime drone flights, operators should follow these best practices. First, pre-flight checks. Before each flight, ensure that the anti-collision lights are fully charged and functioning correctly. Perform a visual inspection to confirm they are securely mounted and oriented in a way that maximizes visibility. Strategic placement. Position the lights on the drone in locations that provide 360 degree visibility. This often involves placing lights on both the top and bottom of the drone to ensure it can be seen from various angles. Monitor battery levels. Keep an eye on the battery levels for both the drone and the anti-collision lights during flight. Ensure that the lights remain operational for the entire duration of the flight as they are crucial for maintaining visibility. Adhere to local regulations. In addition to FAA regulations, be aware and comply with any local or state regulations regarding nighttime drone operations. Some areas may have additional requirements or restrictions. Flying drones at night offers unique opportunities and perspectives, but comes with increased safety risks that must be managed through adherence to FAA regulations and the use of effective anti-collision lights. LumeCube lights are my go-to because they are high quality, reliable lighting solutions that enhance nighttime visibility and safety. There are others out there, so make sure you do your research when choosing an anti-collision light. By following these best practices and ensuring proper use of these lights, drone operators can enjoy the benefits of nighttime flying while minimizing the risks and staying compliant with regulatory requirements. That's it for this video. Thanks for watching. From all of us at Altitude University, stay safe out there and happy flying.